Monday on Live in the Bay, the best beauty picks with our go-to girlfriend, Sadie Murray. Plus, unique wine tasting experiences for the season with wine expert, Danielle Garrido. Live in the Bay, Monday at 1 on Cron 4. Cron 4 is honoring Hispanic heritage with inspiring local stories. Joining us at 11, I'm Catherine Heenan. Cal Fire crews still on the scene of a brush fire near Half Moon Bay. They're watching for hot spots. It began this afternoon off Highway 92 near Quarry Road. Air tankers at one point called in to help. The fire dubbed the Mateo Fire. Crews held it to roughly two acres. In Lake County, evacuation orders are still in place for the Glen Haven fire. It began just before noon Friday near Clear Lake on a hillside off Harvey Boulevard. This is uh, the community of Glen Haven. At least two buildings were destroyed. More than 400 acres burned in that fire, 30% contained. And several agencies have been on the scene of a wildfire in Nevada County. It is being referred to as the Dutch fire. It started about 3.30. Uh, you're looking live at the scene. You can see the fire if you look closely there in the distance. The Nevada County Sheriff's Office did issue a mandatory evacuation orders for Lowell Hill from Dutch Flat Powerhouse to Mule Springs, the Culberson Road area of Dutch Flat. This has burned about 50 acres near I-80. All right, time for a look at the forecast as we take a live look at the uh, Bay Bridge Toll Plaza. And uh, Kathy Trafton is here. Kathy, been talking about a lot of heat. A lot of heat. We've set records today once again. This time in San Rafael. Shattered the old record by 12 degrees, topping out in San Rafael at 106 degrees today. Also, they have had 11 days of 100 degrees plus weather this calendar year. That also is a record. We've also seen records in Oakland. Museum, 97 degrees, 99 degrees for Santa Ro uh, for San uh, Redwood City, that is, and that is also a record. Guess what? It's going to be hot tomorrow at Levi's Stadium. If you're going to watch the 49ers, be ready for exceedingly hot conditions that afternoon. So sunny skies and baking heat.